Hi, I'm Ginger Lapid Vodka, and I am a business consultant and Enneagram author, and I am the owner of the Enneagram in Business, where we offer many resources of all kinds to organizations and to individuals. So I want to share with you some aspects of Enneagram Type 8s that may not be so obvious from the outside looking in. One of those areas is their heart. Um, one of the biggest development areas for AIDS is to get in touch with their heart because it's in the heart where they experience their vulnerability. Now, what are their hearts like though? You know, it's sometimes said some, somebody has a heart of gold. Well, when AIDS get in touch with their heart, it's really a heart of platinum, which is actually more rare and more precious than gold. And that precious heart of the AIDS has been sort of protected and now then, but it's still very pure and very loving and very um, generous. And that's where a lot of their vulnerability lies. And so when they get access to their heart, um, it's, it's a beautiful sight to behold. The second area that may not be obvious about AIDS is that many of them have quite esoteric or unusual interests that they wouldn't really share out loud, not that they're private about it, but it's just not something that would be known. So the best I can give you is an example, but this is just a, an example. Every eight might be different this way. I had a client who was an eight and his very best friend was a Tibetan Buddhist monk who was writing a book on Tibetan Buddhism and he died the month before he completed it. So my client, very big, ran a big um, law firm, international law firm, but he completed this book for his dear, dear friend with incredible insight, um, passion, and love. The, the third area is fear. Um, you know, sometimes eights per are perceived or want to come across as if they have no fear, but actually they have fear just like anybody else. It's just more covered. So um, one of the areas that it would be, you know, being vulnerable is obviously something that makes them scared or fearful, otherwise they'd be able to do it more easily and they grow to that. But just an example of a friend of mine who is um, a coach, and she's an eight, and she didn't realize that she had fear until she went on a safari in South Africa. She wasn't from South Africa. And she was out on the, the uh, with the rangers and all of a sudden the lions were there and she felt fear like she'd never felt before. And it was an incredibly uh, transformative experience for her to feel that. But the funny part of it too is that the lion is actually often used as a symbol for eight. So the very symbol that is for her type was the energy that scared her the most. And she just felt very frightened and um, worked with it and experienced it and it made a big difference in her life. So those are three areas of the eights that might be not so obvious but are very important to understand. Thank you.